But you had a dislocated shoulder before you won the title in 2004. Uh, you took the summer off before you won your second title back in uh, 2008. And this past off season had to have been one of your craziest ever as you become an owner and a rider now with all the things that you have to think about there. So based on your past history, and, and as nutty as this off season might have been, you should be primed and ready to go for another title run, right? Yeah, I think I actually got asked that in a question um, in an interview a couple of weeks ago. But uh, I always do better when I have some time off, you know. Like, I think first you're human and second you're an athlete. So it's nice to get away and, and be, be normal and get to, get to hang out, and especially with what happened in 2008, you know, try to absorb having a, an addition to the family and, and, uh, and the season as a whole. So it was, it's been a great off season. What's been the toughest challenge for you now, taking on the role of owner as well as rider? Honestly, it's, it's been a lot of fun. Um, you know, I'm sure that it's going to have its ups and downs, as, as all racing does. Um, but so far, it's been a lot of fun. You know, I've always been a huge believer in you. You surround yourself by, with good people and, and try to surround yourself with people that can take the weight off your shoulders in, in certain areas. And, and I tried to do that right away, and, and immediately after that, I... I went to work and started training and riding and, and getting ready for the new season. So um, just just trusting people, you know, putting your belief in them that they're going to pull through and, and, and you prepare the best that you know how to do. 